Hi, in this lesson, we're going to learn how to determine the midpoint of a line segment. So you can have a line segment anywhere on your graph. And a line segment, usually you have two points. We say this is A and this is point B. And the length of the line, you would just say A, B, and you would put a little hat on it. But we want to find what is the coordinates of the midpoint. We'll call that M. So M is equal to the midpoint, and then A and B are the end points. Now, how can we determine this? First, let's think about this uh, line segment on a graph. That's just y and x. And each point, you're given a location. This we'll call x1, y1. That's the first endpoint of the line segment. And then b, we have x2 and y2. And we want to know this x, and I'm going to put subscript m because it's midpoint, and ym. This is what we're trying to find. To determine the midpoint, you just have to find the middle of that location. And in the middle of the location is from this point here, we can call this is x, uh, this is y1 because it's the height. And this point right here is y2. This point right here is x1, and we're going to this point here, x2. And we want to find this point here, and it's really easy. All I have to do is find the middle point in my y and find the middle point in my x. To do that, you just take the average. You add them up and divide by 2. What is the average point? Will be the midpoint. So the midpoint. midpoint of your x comma y will be equal to the average x which is going to be x1 plus x2 divided by 2 comma y2 plus y1 divided by 2 and that's your equation you you can uh, use these two points and you just find an average and you can determine the midpoint of a line. Now, a little bit further, why would we want to study this is, if I find the midpoint, what can I do with the midpoint? Is you can actually find a bisect line. Now, a bisect line is a line that is 90 degrees different than your other line. So if I had to find the bisect line, you would, Find the midpoint, and that midpoint is a lo it's a location of this line where they're the same. And you would have to find the slope. So from A, B, you can determine the slope. And to determine, this is called the bisect line, and it's 90 degrees to your other line. You can find the slope here. It's just going to be negative 1 over this slope of AB. Slope of AB. And this is how you could determine and a use for the midpoint. You can use midpoint to determine the bisect line because now you, if I know uh, y is equal to mx plus b, well, if I know the slope here, I could find the slope of this line by dividing one over this slope and then putting it negative. So I know this. And I know a point because this midpoint is going to give you an X and Y location. So if I know this, and I know this, and I know this, I can determine the uh, Y intercept and therefore I can determine an equation for a bisect. Anyways, so now you're going to be working on 1.6 schoolwork.